Hi, Exulium. In order for this tool to work properly, putting aside the tutorial aspect of it, you just need to follow these three simple steps. Step one, be sure that your model have the shop material tab out of you. You can do that by clicking onto your model and clicking the information tab. Now, in this case, my model has five unique entries of the shot material attribute. Step two, once we know that our model has the attribute, we just need to check on it. Click on your model and go to the geometry spreadsheet. Here, you can see we have five different material names on the shot material path attribute. So we have concrete wall, planks brown, roof, and so on. Step three, go to your texture folder. If we click on the geometry spreadsheet and see our textures, we can see that we have the same material name as a prefix on my texture file. So in this case it would be concrete wall 003. We have concrete wall 003, base color, displacement, metallic, normal, and roughness. For plaques brown 10, we have plaques brown 10, black brown 10, displacement, metallic, normal, and roughness. And so on, British material. So if your model and material check these three boxes, you should have no problem using the tool. As a quick demonstration, I will just import a different model. By clicking on the texture importer, I'm gonna select my house 2 and I'm gonna select the house 2 texture folder. The model is imported and textured successfully. There we have it. Now we have the new model in a different geometry set with each material already applied on it. That's it. Thank you for watching. Thank you for considering buying and good luck on your projects.